Hello everybody, it's Chad here. We got us a new toy. We done uh, we done a video a while ago about unboxing of the Prototech. I've not seen many videos of this. So what we're gonna do is kind of show you how it works. It's a septic tank locator. It's got a little sawn and uh, looks like a, a little bitty orange thing. I'll show you here in a minute. But uh, you flush it down the toilet and whenever you flush it, it'll go to your septic tank. And this helps you find the where the lid is so you can dig it up. It saves a lot of time. It uh, keeps you around to probe and everything. But, but it's a neat little device from Prototech. Uh, I ordered it straight from Prototech. I ordered it last week and got it today, so the shipping was real quick on it. But what we're going to do is if we we've got one here in the yard, and I'm going to kind of show you how you do it. But you just cut it on. Batteries are already in it. You just cut it on like that. We could put far or near, whichever one you think you are. So I'll just put it on near because we're pretty close to it. But once you start going, you just put it down, just kind of wave it back and forth. And usually at a house, you know basically where the line is coming out of the house, so you kind of know where you're at. But we can flip it on far. And let's lift, we got the volume up. You can hear it. And you just kind of go where the, be the beeping's at. <clears throat> I don't know if you and all can hear that or not, but... Okay, it's getting a little better, so let's put it on close. Okay, we're getting away from it. Okay, now we're getting closer. Getting louder, so you know you're getting close. And this one's laying on top of the ground, so it, it does a little better than I've seen in a tank, so... You see our meter's pegging out. It's right here. There's what you're looking for. Like I put in my other video, you can tie a piece of fishing line to it and put it through a clean out. Yeah, get it back if you if the tank's too deep or anything happened weird but uh let's cut this down a little bit but you can put a piece of fishing line on it and put it through a clean out take a five gallon bucket of water and let it run down with it and uh, if you couldn't get it dug up you can always pull it back out and uh, these are about 25 a piece 30 30 bucks a piece and uh, they've got three batteries in them, but you can't, you just run them until they run out of battery. You can see it. You can see it's working, it's flashing. So, yeah, and whenever you get it back, you know, you gotta sterilize it and all that stuff, but just cut it off. You can reuse them, I think, a couple times or three. But, but yeah, I just figured I'd do a review on it. It's, it's a pretty handy little device. I mean, I've heard a lot of people say they're worth every penny of it. So, if anybody needs one, I'd go to Prototech, maybe call them. And, uh, hopefully this video helps you out. I know I looked on YouTube, never, I couldn't really find a video on it, so maybe this will help some people out on purchasing one. I've heard good things about them, so I know they make a little more sophisticated ones, but the more sophisticated, the more expensive. So we're trying to keep our costs down right now, because just starting out, you know, we don't want to spend a fortune on something. But, but yeah, that's it. Uh, that's all we got. And uh, like I said, this is Chad from North Buncombe Septic Service. If you're in the Weaverville, Marshall, Mars Hill, Hendersonville area, if you need your septic pump, just give us a holler. And uh, you can look us up online, look us up on Google, and we're on Facebook too. So, anyway, North Buncombe Septic Service, Weaverville, North Carolina, 287-87, 828-775-1985. All right, everybody. Hope this helps everybody, and maybe some people get some use out of this, and 
y'all have a good day and we'll talk at y'all later bye